forth so my team of ex-cons can trap a mystery creature in the most uh, legal place in the quad. You want to throw in a discount? Discuss the status of my official team membership badge. Trax! Once again, there is no official badge! <laughs> Obviously, you would not have one, Assassin. A small one indicated the procedure is a well done. Alright, secret. Rocket, stop, stop messing with him! Okay, here we go. We're going in. We saw a few tips for the next time, though, actually. That's one. No, of course, security good resets every rotation. We don't want to be in and out before our code expires, so we'll really get started. For the next reset, we'll get a full rotation to do this. Nice. <laughs> oh, why is the Novanet still up? I thought we were going in. Here's the assassin's contacts are as untrustworthy as the betrayer herself. Oh, please don't tell me Gamora's backdoor codes are bust. We nearly went broke getting them. Relax, Rocket. We still got a few ticks before the next time window. The network just reset. You can enter the sequence, Peter. Zero, four, five, one. That's it? Four digits? Suspicious. These security measures are too simplistic for Novacore. It's not that simple. The code only works on this date for this ship. Oh, I get it. Gamora's codes are more like an encryption key of some sort, designed to integrate temporal coordinates and our ship's hard-coded serial into a local number generator. Info gets in. Digits come out. Four of them. There. wasn't very popular in the Shatari army, especially with Thanos in charge. Yeah, it's probably all harmless now. I mean, Novacore had 12 years to get rid of the heavy-duty explosives, right? That's why I like you, Quill. You're so pure. Oh, the wonderful and terrible things I could do with all this. Stay focused, Rodent. We do not come here to scavenge. Why not? The Milano's weapon systems could use an overhaul. Plus, there's good money in it. The piece that we seek is far more valuable to the monster queen of Seknoth 9 than any illegally acquired salvage. Oh! oh the place is really shifty. I'm not seeing a monster. That big cylinder up ahead looks like the mining ship Peter's friend said to look for. Friend? For a night? And you'll see the monster as soon as we place Rocket's monster summoning thingies. Flark, yeah. Group well soda. Team Rockets up first. I still do not understand why I must remain on board with the assassin. Oh, because you're part of Green Team. You assigned me to the team before you named it. My skin is not green. It's teal. Teal? What? Listen, if we want to trick the monster into going inside that mining rig, we need to place thumpers on both sides. Two sides, two teams. And two clicks at the drop site. Congrats to a safe plan of ship. You'll need to jump. That's our cue. Let's go, bro. <laughs> Don't worry. Once the thumpers are placed, we'll meet in the middle and we'll capture the monster. Together. Very well. Number one, done. Meet you at the rendezvous point. Mora, take care of my baby. It should be Peter, my child. Oh, oh. can you imagine? What, a pink coop? It's a custom nano rest, designed to keep all this war stuff from floating away. I'm 
thinking that big cylinder thing is our rendezvous? Yep, that's the mining rig. So weird seeing it all clustered together like this. Bits and pieces of a war that spanned the entire galaxy held together by... Pink goo. Abrium-based nano-resin. Whatever. I'm just saying, it's a lot to take in. Oh, look! Yellow and blue! Looks like an old Nova Corp ring. Nice! Come on, dude. People probably died on that ship. Killjoy, why do you even bring us here if the place is so sacred? I could name at least a dozen planets with monsters on them, so why here? You think it's to impress Gamora? Like, flat broke, Rocket. We need a big break. Aren't you tired of eating yarrow root? It's so... mealy. Listen, this is a restricted zone. Whatever monster lives here... Whoa! I'm okay! Ha! Almost made yourself a very late war casualty. Not funny. You know, I like this. This is fun. The three of us hanging out, just like when we started this gig, before you know who joined us. I do not hate everybody. I tolerate Quill. Quill's a swell guy. Come on, Rocket. Drax and Gamora are valued additions to the team. You're only saying that because she's listening. Careful on that thing, Quill. You spot something out there? Just imagine what kind of blasters the Jadari had to use to wreck some of these frigates. I'm not being insensitive. Pretty sure that way's a dead end. Uh, you sure? Ah, there we go. Half this way. Come on. How can you even tell? Just trust me, all right? Hey, group. you think we could find pieces of the Trion shard in here? How do you even know the other way was a dead end? Because, unlike you, I have a very keen sense of direction. First time playing this game. This is dope. unit says I can clear more of these suckers than you. As if. Oh, what the? Rocket, did you do that? The scoreboard? You like it? Hacked it into your visor cover last time you took a snooze. You hacked into my stuff? Considering how many times I fixed the flarkin thing, it might as well be my stuff. Optimal thumper placing distance should be just up ahead. I'm thinking right in front, through the giant hole. Ah! Ah, amazing! Oh. I should have been recording. Bridge over. I want to see if he's alive. I don't know, but he's twitching. Look, it's Scott State, Will. You okay down there? Yep. Yeah, just, uh... Thought I saw a shortcut. shortcut. Right. Go ahead without me. I'll catch up. Okay. There's a crapped out Nova Corps missile bay just on the other side. We'll meet you there. Yellow and blue missile bay. Got it. Hey, Gamora, make sure the Milano don't get stuck in any of this present. 
she did. I would wrench the ship free. Don't worry. I've flown worse ships through worse situations. You fall into another hole, Quill? I'm, uh, assessing stuff. If all else fails, shoot something. Hey, Drax, what makes you so sure this Hell Lady is going to buy our monster? Her name is Lady Hellbender. And her collection of rare creatures is outdone only by the wealth she showers on those who procure them. If someone was playing top of you and her weirdos, I'd know about it. She is an honorable warrior. Not one of you back out. Oh, fuck! No, no, I don't that! Well, was that you? I shot something, like you said. I've got a way forward. Ooh, don't die, don't die, don't die! Aw, hey, little guy. You guys should have seen that. It was this weird. Not falling for this again. Watch out, eyeballs! He told us, Mirko! He'll be fine! You warned. I was attacked by... Strange... Installing a thumper. <laughs> Must be working then. What they look like? A spine door with multiple ocular intrusions. We'll keep an eye out. Get it? Get it? <laughs> uh, well, we got a lot riding on your gal pal's mystery monster tip. I hope she's legit. <laughs> like you could even tell if she had an honest face. <laughs> Trust in the plan, guys. Everything is checked out so far, right down to the mining ship. We put our thumpers in the right places, and we'll bag that monster. Uh, Will knows all about putting thumpers in the right places. <laughs> and getting monsters in the sack, too. <laughs> Mother of Scott! Whoa! Oh! Oh, oh, uh, are you kidding me? Jump that! You don't gotta jump. There's a sturdy support beam on this side. Get Groot to grow or break across. Just ask him nice like. He does it for me all the time. All right, Groot. Let's see that cool party. It's one hell of a party trick, big guy. Gross. More ship eaters. All right. Boom. Right under your nose, Quill. Nova Centurions probably had to tow all the scrap to one place. We gotta go that way, across the gap, somehow. Gamora. When are you going to share your contacts and sources? When will you share yours? What? Yeah, it's close enough for Groot the Bridge if you can find a proper handhold. So, Drax, how come you're so in love with this Hellbender lady? I do not love Lady Hellbender. Yeah, shouldn't you be all like, 
Her name is Ilochka. You cannot bet her. Hey, Greenies, you see any blue and gold ships out there, you let us know. We have seen many such ships. He needs active ones. We haven't talked about what to do with the right to a Nova Corps patrol. Uh, we'll restrain them until we are done here. Bad idea. Any sign of cops, we surrender, okay? We do not surrender. I'm with Drax on this one. We all have criminal records, and they'll be looking for any excuse to arrest us. I may have a couple aces up my sleeve when it comes to the bucket heads, but if we resist them, all bets are off. Plan to play cards with them and cheat? Yeah, basically. Of course there ain't any plants here. It's a junkyard. Plants? Okay, here we go. All right, set her down right there. Yep, one to go. What? No, no! Flark and Skaggy! They're attacking batteries, Fry. That's what's wrong. Maybe you put it down too hard. Let's just find a solution. The solution's a new battery, with a charge. Okay, we're on what's left of a ship. Full of ship things. Gotta be things that power ship things around here, right? Yeah. Maybe you're gonna want to use your visor for this. You find a replacement while I finish scraping the fry wires. Found a compressor! No charge! Uh, no charge, no good. Do I look worried? The resin will hold. You ain't that heavy. Huh. Worth a shot. Any bets on what this monster's gonna look like? How many legs? Like, uh, more than four? It will be majestic. What does that look like? You shall see. Nope. So much for that. How do we know the monster we're looking for ain't one of these things we already killed? Is it more worthy of Lady Hellbender's collection? <laughs> hey! A huge power generator! How do we hook it up? We don't! That thing would toast our little bumper. Can't we condense the power through a routing funnel or something? Don't try to make up tech stuff. It's irritating. Find something else. the pieces. Keep looking. All this firepower. Now it's all just scrap. Yeah. Sorry, bud. Sorry about what? Groot's people never even got a chance to fight. Old Destin planet was torched at the start of the war. Did you pump here? No good. It would draw power directly from the ship. Right! Yeah. I knew that.
That's not it. Found something with a charge. Kind of looks like a spacey car battery. Okay, this thing isn't gonna zap me, right? The chance is minuscule at best. You'll be fine. Here you go. That'll do nicely. Just let me tinker a bit. I'll have to do some tweaking once I see how much juice this thing put. What's up? So, uh, watch my back. Watch it from what? Rocket! How are these battles some critters? No, 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 Scott! If I don't rewire this fast, it's gonna short circuit. Looks like it's all us, bro. Bay accept that passage, bud. Well, we found a way out. Groot's wondering if the reward's gonna be worth all the risk we're taking for this job. Me and Groot are nearly unkillable, but what if the rest of you don't make it out alive? Guys, we deliver this monster to Lady Hellbender, we'll get bigger payouts and jobs that don't suck. A ship for each one of us. I mean, a team only needs one ship. Perhaps a more spacious ship. Man, that thing is ridiculous. I think it was a ship or a robot. That's a pre-century, a robot, but it would have been space-worthy. <laughs> that ain't even the biggest one. They designed at least five experimental models twice that size. How do you know all this? Because they were my fellow experiments back on Half-World. Most of my parts came from the cybernetics hangar next to the door, so uh, I got a sneak peek at all the new killbots. I can see the parts come and go from my, uh, uh, my cage. I didn't mean to open old wounds. <laughs> Most of them are just scars now anyways. I wasn't even a person to the worst of the Kree's mad scientists. More like a real smart walking gun. A very talkative gun. <laughs> yeah, that part was an accident. They tried to fix it a few times. <laughs> The entire facility! I wish I got that and blown it up before the end of the war. Rocket! Think you can hack that thing? Bring it closer? It's dead, Quill. Groot, need you to shoot a bridge right into that eye socket. Now, I want to see you do that to something in combat. Wait, is that... Yes! I'm about to win that thing, Quill! Here 
goes nothing. <laughs> We're inside a giant robot head. And I got robot parts inside my head. Got robot parts inside your head. Inside a giant robot head. Ha <laughs> ha! <Eat that. laughs> hey, Groot, what do you think I should do when I win this battle? I mean, with the units he'll owe me once I win. You know what, Quill? I think it's unfair. You got two guns, I got one. I think my points should count double from now on. That's cheating. All right, bumper goes. It's not gonna piss off every critter around, right? Sorry, Quill. Not taking no chances after the last one. I gotta test it real quick. Not again. Lucky. I only flipped the switch on and off to see if it started. Gotta love that kill radius. Let's go BOOM! Points like that. Not installing our bumpers. Great job. We'll meet you at the mining ship. Mining rig is right there. Of course it's secure. As secure as a broke down Jatari shipwreck's ever gonna be. Come on, Groot. We need to get across here. The rocket wouldn't put you at risk, right? That's right. I've always got your back, bud. Nah, it just looks unstable like everything else in you. Don't get your twigs in a bundle. Yes! The resin can hold a stupid warship! <laughs> I'm telling you, it's totally safe. See? I'll even prove it. Huh? Look at this. Uh, rocket? Oh, fuck. Nice jump! No! 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 You're okay! Fine. 
piece of moldy driftwood, you could have died saving me! I love you too, you selfless son of a truck. Come on, Cool. He says I'll meet us at the mining ship. I don't want to make him wait. That's it? You're not going after him? He says it's fine! We'll meet him later! Team Rocket, is everything okay? Our signal just went dark. His radio must have broke when he fell. Rocket knocked an old shipwreck off balance and we lost Groot. What? Is he hurt? I didn't do nothing. It fell on its own. And Groot's why? Team Rocket out. Why'd you have to go and tell Green Team the accident's my fault? Groot's fine anyways. There's nothing to worry about. An accident, Rocket? Come on! What? That's all it was. It's your fault! If you hadn't fooled around on that ship... I did you don't know nothing. Stop trying to be smart. That sure didn't sound like an apology. Nope. I do not see the mining ship amid all this wreckage. Look around. It's hard to miss. Great big metal cylinder. Closer than ten Shatari nailed to a ship. I don't know, what? One Shatari nailed to ten ships. <laughs> nice! <laughs> Man! If that afterburner kicked on right now, we'd be toast. Let's hope it don't, because we have to find a way through this thing. Mind the ship's on the other side of that turbine, so we gotta find a way through. Try not to jump on anything this time. Groot's not there to grab you if you... Well, either shut up or help me figure out how these blades are. Hey, hey, what gets louder as it gets smaller? I don't know. A Shatari in a trash compactor! <laughs> <laughs> oh, man! That was rough, but good! How do you make a dead Shikari float? Hell, you take your foot off its head. <laughs> I think Yandu told me that one. Only good Shatari is a dead Shatari. Yeah, Korax was okay. I wonder how he's doing. Hey, Gamora. Did you really drop off the Shatari queen? Kill it, I... That was you! Nova Corps always claimed they ended the war. They would take all the credit. I can hear your visor working. Better not be cheating on our bet, Quill. How can you hear that? There's a drone access tunnel over here. Too bad we don't got a drone. Can you squeeze in there? Knew it. Rocket, fix the thing. Rocket, clean up the mess. Rocket, crawl into the mystery hole. See anything? Yeah, a manual override. Team Rocket, we had a snack. One of our center points was covered in resin, so we're gonna fly around to get another spot. Just make sure the new spot as close as possible to the original one. Because of ah, maps and angles. Great. Another turbine. Yeah, that is how these things are usually built. Ooh, ooh. War! It's stuck on something. Boop. Someone's been practicing. 
Come on! Let's get out of here! We're back on track. The mining ship ain't too far. You think Groot's already ahead of us? Maybe. Hope he didn't get distracted. Crap, 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 crap! It wasn't me this time, I swear! I don't like this! Hope I don't tear my pants! I'm ripping this thing with muscles I didn't even know I had! so sure that swarm thing was inoffensive. I feel kind of bad about releasing it. Quill took a pot shot at this massive worm nest. Chunk of something fell off and the big floaty creature came out of it. That's all. How do you make a dead Shikari float? 
take your foot off its head. What? What's not to get? There you go. Rendezvous coordinates are that way. But we'll have to find a way around the rubble. I'll try to find a side passage. Look at this old beauty. A table. This is a vintage Model T engineering workbench. They don't make them sturdy like that no more. Hey, come on, Quill. Let's see if this beauty still works. Maybe I can fix up your gear. Hey, hand me that part. One fine tech upgrade, hot and fresh. No siree, Bob. Yeah, there's a way through, if we can clear out that crud. One stubborn bunch of lore. Try that quick cool down I saw. So you can keep helping. You gotta time it just right to overcharge the phase cooling. And, uh, thanks for the upgrade. Uh, seems a little wobbly. You guys hang back a sec. Well, Scott! Ah, uh, this place is crawling with ugly! Guys, nothing wrong with you out here!
their soft flesh is primed for slicing. I'm missing all the fun! Rip them a new one! This one mocks our every effort! My turn! near the last thumper spot. We'll head that way and keep an eye out for you. How's my baby? You can see for yourself if you can get back up there. I can take it up there, but we're going to need something for you two to climb up on. It is a wonder the nimble assassin has not offended us over any tracks. At least he called me nimble. It was not intended to be. Let's see that fancy footwork, Gamora. Bet you can't do this. That is physically impossible. Okay, sort of making progress. Drax, any thoughts? I am debating whether to employ the Kershengar lunge to subdue our monster, and whether that would be inadvertently fatal. Drax. Think you can half that container? Behold the might of a Katathian warrior! Well, that's helpful. I did as our leader bid. Not all of us are so quick to disobey. Make up your mind. Are you mad I served Thanos or that I betrayed him? Neither inspire confidence. Evo, Drax! With ease. It'll look real good right here. Understood. Remember this moment should you ever think of crossing me, assassin. I'll remember how slowly you move. Huh? All right, Rocket. We're back on track. Oh, oh yeah. Uh, good for you. Oh, yeah. It ain't stealing if it's a bandit. We. Oh. We don't even know what it looks like. The intel was extremely vague. It wasn't vague, it was rushed. It's probably some cute little... Nightmarish abomination. Lady Hellbender is a renowned warrior. An ideal specimen would reflect that strength. Like I said, something scary. I disagree. Strength is endearing. I bet it's something cute. Women dig. Whoa! Careful! You got some timing. We got company. Is this from the last number? We haven't even placed it yet. This place. Here's room for our quarry. We'll not be far behind. Let's take Marcus and Nell to put it through ourselves.
gorged with the thrum of battle. Didn't need to hear that. Come on, last thumper spot is this way. How do you know? My senses are fine-tuned to measure even the tiniest vibrations. Really? No, I'm tracking it on my display. The Milano should be right on the other side of this door. It was open when I came through here. Who says I tripped on something? Murder Mom probably closed the door behind me. It looks like it's still got some juice. Give it a go, Rocket. What the genius at work? You are a miracle worker, man. I have to say, that is an immaculate part of the job. Thanos never tolerated imperfection. <laughs> yeah, yeah. This is it. Last spot. I can't wait to be out of here. This place feels like it's about to collapse on itself. I cannot wait to meet our monster. I thought you were mostly interested in meeting the buyer. She is a respectable collector. Is it working? Yeah, yeah. Don't worry, Sunshine. <laughs> to be broken! Ain't nothing broke! That's the sound it's supposed to make! What sound? You can't hear that! Hear what? Our monster. Hey, that thing is fast! Don't let it get behind you! It could be poisonous! Lady, help me to look at that stone that's poisonous! That's one less thing to hide behind. Good thinking, well. Not a monster. Adorable. It's more matted than an Asgardian goat. We cannot present this pathetic creature to the monster queen of Sektoff 9. She will laugh at us. Maybe we can use it as bait. I knew those thumpers wouldn't work. What? My thumpers are state of the art. Musclehead's the one who rushed at the first thing that came through the door. My head is not made of muscle. Seeing what I'm seeing? Yes, that is a monster. Face wave. All right, enough with the warm up. Time to catch this a real with monster. the fucking lava. Let's see. <laughs> Got that llama for your mama. What the hell's name is that? Definitely not cleaner bots. Watch it! Let's strap it out. We gotta get out of here! Now, the first is volatile ruin! Let's go! <laughs> this game is an instant classic. Fucking llama. Hold on to your foot, people! Rocket, hit the music! On it! Focus on flying, Peter! Someone play this man a song! <laughs> no, talk! Watch the ship! I'm watching, I'm watching! You wait! Drax, what are you doing? Uh, I'm holding my buttons. You're full instruction. Uh, someone give me a hand! <laughs> Am I right? How about one inside the head? Through is through. 
ridiculous. This place lacks the eternal frost. Your hell is frozen. The Tathians do not like to be cold. Try putting on a shirt! From. Means you screw it up because you have to fly away from it. Uh, please don't be Nova Corps. Please don't be Nova Corps. Please don't be Nova Corps. It is Nova Corps. <laughs> Hell yeah! Guardians of the Galaxy. It's a patrol ship. Designation, Alice Hope. Busted! Um, <clears throat> there's a uh, uh, thing I got, I gotta do. I'll, I'll be right back. We need to get rid of that animal. Now. <sighs> I'm serious, Peter. If it stays on the ship, we all go to prison. No one's going to jail. It's a harmless space llama thing. Harmless? Remember Anakupi? Not really, no. That's because they scorched the planet because an idiot smuggled in Exelon. I will eject the beast into space. Whoa, 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 we're not ejecting anything. It'll make us look guilty. It could be carrying Zephron's disease. Which is why Drax is going to hide in the secret cargo compartment behind Groot's plants. Peter. Jason. Quill. Hey, girl! Hey, Grell! How you doing? How long's it been? Two, three years? You look good. You been tanning? This is a new low, Peter. Even for you. Grell, I swear it's not what it looks like. That you're a junker trespassing in the most restricted area of space? Who can search with thieves and murderers, apparently. Hey, killing people for money ain't murder, lady. Come on, Grell. You know me. We've been to hell and back. Sure, I've done some shady stuff since the war, like, really shady stuff. But junking? I just caught you pink-handed, leaving the quarantine zone. Technically, yes, but we weren't scavenging. Right. Mr. Coyle, I found these items in the uh, space that you told me about. There was not enough room for both the other thing and these. Peter <laughs> Under Galactic Law ZXP-47, I am putting you and your crew under arrest. Actually, can I call you back? What? Please tell me that is not a crate of super illegal tech. It is a crate of super illegal tech, which also happens to be very valuable. Really? What? We're on a Ravager ship. Even the fucking bulkheads are stolen. Well, we can't fit both in the compartments. I will really check the crate with this space. Check the crate and I melt your face. Milano's weapon systems are four generations behind We need that tech. More than we need some stupid farm animal. That farm animal could be a class 3 biohazard. You want to end up in the kiln? 
Hide Rocket's crate. Peter, you're willing to gamble on a space llama thingy? I'll <laughs> Corel, the llama's harmless. She knows me. And I know Corel. Not like I did. You slept with a cop? He wasn't a cop back then. The point is, I can get us out of this, guys. You just gotta trust me. Oh, and that will be your boarding party. Lawbreaking pirates like you. That's just it. We're not pirates. We're legally incorporated heroes for hire. Yeah, that's right. You check those records, Buckethead. Nova Corps licensing permit 67398-2. Gardeners of the Galaxy? But no. Rocket. So I let the crew fill out the paper. I fixed it in the Not the most well-known heroes you could hire, but definitely in the top five of most awesome names. Contributing members. Groot, a Flora Colossus. Last of his kind, fearless in a firefight, an awesome best friend. Rocket, bona fide super genius and a wizard with explosives. Definitely not a raccoon. Gamora, adopted daughter of Thanos, deadliest woman in the galaxy. Need we say more? Drax the Destroyer, convicted serial murderer and galactic war hero. Often grumpy. Last and definitely least, Peter Jason Quill. <laughs> That's all you wrote? It was a captain with this. Sorry, excuse me, I just need to. Hey, that gold. What are you doing here? Oh, you don't know? Really? It says right here prisoner processing training. I'm your official trainee. Aren't you a little young for the core? Aren't you a little old for that hairdo? I should check with the captain. No. No, 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 no. She, she definitely signed off on this. You know how thorough she is about signing stuff? If I may, sir, the real concern here is Regulation 7A regarding prisoner footgear. That one's jet boots are in clear violation. They're, they're decorative. Good work to that gold. No, you do not got this, pirate. I got this. Now fall in line. Not the golf prisoner. Watch the jacket. To that gold. You know the arrest protocols? All memorized, sir. The first thing we do. The first thing you do is apologize. We're legitimate business like folk on legitimate like business. There's so much wrong with this arrest. A, no way a kid should be. <laughs> An official trainee. And B, I'm very, very close friends. Captain. Uh huh. Hold it right here. Is there a problem? Yes! No faith, energy, no power. No power. No containment. Techs are looking at it. They say they cannot even fathom. How can they fix what they cannot understand? Put the Grand Unifier's mind at ease. Run the scanners again. What the fuck is a Grand Unifier? Grand Unifier Breaker. Leader of the Church of Universal something. He was floating dead in the quarantine zone. Looking for God. Let's go. We caught him just like we caught you. The difference is, I know the captain. As I was saying, <laughs> just tell the captain. Your mom explicitly said she doesn't want to see you. Yeah, Quill. Wait, just be no. super clear you on the mom. <laughs>
Nice work. Thanks. You didn't do too bad yourself. Pirate. Only Star Lord. Or Peter, or, you know, you have a good head butt saver. Okay. Peter. So, listen. I have some good news. And some bad news about your friends. Give me the good news. We're all fine. I mean, they all have life signs. So, what's the bad news? They've been processed and put in the brig. Come on. We'll be safe through here. Clark! Pikes must have burst. Should we try using that thingamajig of yours to call someone? We don't need help. I know what I'm doing. Now help me block this fire so we can get through. Sure. Just that everyone must be worried. Captain's kit goes easy, does it? There, see? They don't need to worry about me. Enough people around here do that already. Look, there's the adult in the room. <laughs> yeah, adult isn't exactly how my mom described you. How did Corel describe me? Rock. Is that robot wearing makeup? What? Oh, yeah. That's just it. I, um, I know all the bots down here. They're kind of my friends, I guess. I read a program most of them. You gave them faces. Maybe. No, I mean it's cool. Personality. Very cool. Come on. This way. Does your mom know you play down here? Probably not. But what else am I gonna do? Not like there's any other kids on board. You know, I didn't have a lot of friends at your age either. Granted, I was in prison, but still. So mom was right about you. It was a Atari prison. I was just a kid. I have so many questions. Do you know my mom, exactly? Uh, we fought together on Mercury during the war. She was, a, is, a real spitfire. More like real controlling. And bossy, and judgmental. You're just a kid, Nikki. You don't know what's good for you, Nikki. Stay out of your skate pods, Nikki. <laughs> I kind of know what you mean. You do? This is a new low, Peter. Even for you, Peter. Are you sure this is the quickest way to the brig? You didn't want to go to the brig. Okay. Just trust me. I want to show you something. This way. If this is an attempt to escape your mom's ship, I really need to know. Because I may or may not be super interested. Just really need to make sure it doesn't look like a kidnapping. What? No, no. Oh, wow. Don't laugh. No, no! Is this your mom? Single-handedly winning the war? Obviously, I know she didn't do it by herself. No. That final push was, uh... It was a massive team effort. Were you there? Uh, I contributed to the war effort... differently. Pirating? Raiding. Which is, you know, the good kind of pirating. Is this... Krilar? Uh, yeah. Long time ago. Kid stuff. I could do it way better now. No, no, it's good. Morbid, but good. Need a hand? Nope. But thanks. I'm almost done. Hey! Secret stuff. Off limits. No adults. I get it. Anyway, I'm all done here. We should probably get back before Mom completely freaks. Yeah, I've seen your mom overreact before. I'm not a kid anymore, you know? Tell me about it. So, you get where I'm coming from, right? Like, if you do end up talking to my mom, the subject of me happens to come up. Say no more. I'll make sure Corel knows what a good job you did. No! I mean, thanks. But ideally, Mom never needs to know I was in a hangar at all. So I never saw you? Exactly! Never saw me! Never saw my past key! You may have heard of Nikki Gold and how cool she is, but that's it. You need a hand? Yes! Got it! Mom? I can explain. Nikki, I'm fine. Mom, um, seriously. Hey, okay. Barely a scratch. What in hell is Nikki thinking? Sneaking out with an arresting squad. Running around with criminals! Alleged criminals? You almost died! Do you have any idea how grounded you are right now? Mom! 
You promised to give me more leeway. Leeway doesn't mean mine to my officers. Or sneaking around behind my back. Look, it's my fault some guy's ship blew up. Restricted areas are restricted for a reason. You treat me like a prison. You're a child. Are you even listening? Whoa, whoa. We've all been through a lot today. Let's just all take a deep breath and recognize that maybe we've all made some mistakes. Make sure the fire is at and the hangar secure. Yes, Commander. And find out why that churchman's shuttle exploded. Grand Unifier Raker has been less than cooperative. Make him cooperate. And you two? With me. I knew you'd overreact. You always overreact. Even Peter was saying so. Oh, he was, was he? I suspect Peter misspoke, something he often tends to do. For what it's worth, Nikki totally saved my butt. She handled herself really well. You have every reason to be proud of her. Coming from you, Peter, it's worth extraordinarily little. Why are you being mean to him? Just listen to what he's saying. I don't care what he's saying. Upper level. Captain's quarter. Initiate lockdown. Lockdown initiated. <sighs> what, are you going to kill us? In theory, these doors don't open until I say so. Yeah, I know how lockdown works. I don't think you do, because somehow you keep bypassing every security measure on this ship, and I want to know how. Or you can just show me. Mom! You know, this reminds me of the last time I was stuck in an elevator. I was with this Shi'ar girl, and she... Ew! What is wrong with you? She was a lovely person. Someone, please get out of here. No one leaves until you tell me what I want to know. You already know everything! No, I don't. I know you're a magnet for danger. And that you somehow keep getting caught in restricted areas of this ship. I'm small. Okay? I fit into places. Being small doesn't get you past security, or through the hangar bay checkpoint, or the maintenance tunnel blast doors, or even into the sub-level I just found you in. There was that system-wide glitch, remember? Yeah. Yeah, security was down for a while. No, it wasn't. Seemed pretty down to me. Are you seriously lying for a 12-year-old right now? 12? Oh, wow, I thought she was at least 16. Peter! What? She really knew her stuff. She's a smart kid. Too smart. She keeps bypassing security. Unless you have a level 6 access to my ship all of a sudden? Didn't think so. Nicolette Gold, empty your pockets. No. You empty your pockets. Nikki? I still have feelings for you. Excuse me? Not like feelings, feelings. More like emotions. You know, because the explosion and me and you and everything we went through back in the war. I lost a lot of feelings to build up. I'm good now. Okay, good. Now, if you don't mind. I'm not hiding anything. I would do that. To be continued. Disengage, log down. Log down, disengage. So, can I go help secure the hangar now? No, you can go back to your quarters and you can stay there for the next 30 rotations. But, Mom! I can make it 30 cycles. Own trespassers, missing kid. I have no idea. Chewie. I can't believe you still have him. I can't believe you survived. Maybe it was what, like a thousand degrees? More like a thousand cycles ago. You can keep him if you want. He is yours. Hey, I ordered him to look out for you. Expect him to keep doing his job. Especially, you now have a daughter, apparently. Twelve-year-old daughter, we didn't have during the war. Twelve years ago, when we... Peter. Peter. 
When we picked up your ship, part of me was excited. At first. But then after all this time, you haven't changed. At all. You're still the same. I've changed. Whatever the fine is, I'll pay. Just give me three cycles. Let me prove that I'm not still whatever it is you're going to finish that sentence with. You're going to pay 8,000 units in three cycles? Wow, okay, that is a lot of money. I was thinking that maybe... The fine's non-negotiable. My search party found a Class II biohazard wandering around your ship. That's all they found, right? Okay, okay, you'll get your money on time, no problem. This Guardians of the Galaxy thing, we are this close to getting it off the ground. Goddamn long. <laughs> and if have these handcuffs on, I would show you just how very close we are. Why do I feel like I'll regret this? No, come on. When have I ever... You won't regret it! Promise. Too late! You've got three cycles, Peter. Not four, not five. Get away! Contact me when you've got the unit. And if we don't? The device we installed will deactivate your ship. And you will all go to Pinnacle. Gotcha. We won't let you down. What the hell, Peter? You said you could get us out of this. I did. 8,000 units is a small price. 8,000 units? That is a tremendous sum. Where are we gonna get that kind of money in three cycles? By robbing a freaking bank, apparently. Okay, so we got fined. We have a Nova tracking thing on our ship that's gonna shut down our engines if we don't pay that fine in three cycles. At least we're not on a prisoner transport. Not yet. Oh, come on, guys. You're Drax the Destroyer, man. You killed Thanos. Allegedly. Are you gonna let a little fine slow you down? Hey, Gamora, you're practically an MI6 agent, but way hotter and, and cooler. There's nothing you can't do. Here it comes. Rocky, you're an actual genius and the scrappiest dude I know. How many prisons did you break out of? Seven. Seven. You are Groot. Guys, we're supposed to be a team. All we need to do is figure out how broke we are and come up with a plan. <laughs> Check your quarters. Check between the sofa cushions. Check under the crafting bench. If you find any spare units lying around, grab them. I'll do the same in my quarters. All right. This is why you don't sleep with cops, Quill. They put bombs on my ship. My ship. <laughs> Busted. I am watching you, Rodent. What's that supposed to mean? It is common knowledge that Rodent's hoard, nuts, stolen technology, Units. <sighs> okay. First off, I ain't a hoarder, nor a rodent. Peter Quill, tell the rodent that his selfishness endangers us all. Rocket, we could really use any extra units you have. How do I gotta spell it out for you? I don't got no units. Fair enough. You leave his lies? Oh, I ain't lying. Now why don't you leave me alone and bother someone else instead? I intend to. Open this door! I know you are in there, Cynthia! Do not think that I do not know what you are up to. Your rodent co-conspirator has clearly stashed his illicit units. So are you? You cannot hide behind this door forever! Drax, let it go! Nobody's stashing units! We shall see. Thanks for telling him. So, you here to talk or uh, you just want to gear up? Great. You're not still upset, are you? It'd be a lot better if we didn't have three. Hey, very interesting. What? I should know. Hey. Still on the fence about the brand name, but uh, keeping the Milano as collateral was a pretty smart move. Never agreed. If you'd rather, I'd turn you in. Don't worry, you better.
Let's see if we can find some stray units in here. Really? Thirty-seven units? <laughs> Appear to be 7,963 units short. We intend to keep our ship, Peter Quill. I know, I know. We clearly need a plan. Reconsider my initial proposal. Ah, oh, no, not Fin Fang Foom again. Yes, we should go after Fin Fang Foom. Drax, there are Fin Fang Foom. Okay. Like, what about selling Gamora's crane? What? Oh, come on. You've been hoarding them stupid knickknacks ever since you first joined us. I mean... Don't tell me they ain't worth nothing. Quarantine zone was always holding out on My this figurines floor. are not knickknacks. Huh, team's in trouble. Then you can't oh, have it to make no sacrifice. Of course, the I will sacrifice system. your head. And take us to the magic Guys! I think we should hear our group for once. He says we should combine both ideas. Sell Gamora's trinkets to Fin Fang Foom. It is brilliant. Yeah, you know, the only problem with your plan is that Lady Hellbender only buys monsters, and you are not a monster. He's not. He's the sweetest, most. I am Groot. No, you don't. This ain't something you can pretend. I am Groot. Oh, yeah? You want monster? I'll show you monster! Whoa, guys! Groot, are you really offering to- No, no, he is not offering that, okay? It could work. So, Groot, I guess we could bust him out after. Absurd! Lady Hellbender seeks the monster with him. The small, ugly one is clearly the correct choice. He's cruel, sadistic, and his soul is filthy. Filled with rage. The Monster Queen would pay a great sum for such a creature. Really? How great? How are you okay with this? Because I know what I am. And I know what he ain't. I am Groot. I vote we sell Groot. I honestly think Lady Hellbender will go for it. Yeah, well, I vote for not Groot. I also vote for the creepy little beast. Two votes each. Peter? Well, Rocket's definitely scarier on the inside. He's unstable and vicious and totally oblivious to the needs of others. <clears throat> okay, we, uh, we get it. The point is, is I think you'd make a fine monster. And we'll definitely need that tactical brain of yours to bust you out once you're in there. But just to be 100% sure, you're definitely okay with this. Uh, are you kidding? I can't wait to hold this over you. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Let's go sell a monster. We're not seriously flying into that. You see, the weather patterns of Sekmarf 9 are tied to the temperament of this room. That's not how women work. Poor oh, weather. Anyways, I'm sure it looks worse than it is. He can't be serious. What? This way we can scope things out before we finish the transaction. We're like a hundred clicks from her base. You know how much I like scoping. Nope.
dry up. That's what I want to do after this mission.